Hi friends, Nick here from Technology Lowdown. Today we're looking at Pi-Hole and upgrading from the development version, which you may have been on or switched to when you watched one of my previous videos, to the actual production version, which is in line with Pi-Hole 5.0. So to do this, you will need to SSH into your Raspberry Pi or into your system that is running Pi Hole. For me, it is on a Proxmox system, uh, on a Proxmox VM, but it will be the same whether you're running it on physical hardware, on a Raspberry Pi, or in a VM. So let's jump straight into this today. Uh, I'll just show you the screen. So here we go. We'll jump into Raspberry into the Pi Hole system in the web browser. I'll just log in and if you scroll down the bottom you can see that I'm running Pi-hole version dev 5.0 and the web interface is also version 5 as well so to get this upgraded what we need to do is open up our terminal and we want to SSH into our um, Raspberry Pi so I'll just uh, reconnect so I'll connect to the Raspberry Pi it's on dot 27 I'll paste in my password there all right so I'm into there if I go pi hole in this menu and I just go hyphen V I'll paste my password in again we should also be able to confirm here that yes we are on version 5 so to do this pi hole makes it really easy in fact if you're on pi hole a uh, pi hole help we get a full list of all the commands that will assist us so what the process is, is we need to check out the main release of Pi-hole. If we have a look down here, we've got switch Pi-hole subsystems to a different GitHub branch. Add the H for more info on the checkout usage. All right, so let's do that. So we'll go Pi-hole and we'll do checkout and we'll do hyphen H. Okay, here's our options. So we have Pi-hole, Checkout, Core, Web. We've also got Master, Dev, and Branch Name. Okay, so what we need to do is switch to Pi-hole, Checkout. We want to check out the Master, which is the latest stable release. The Dev is the one which you would have been on if you switched to Pi-hole, and you want to try it out before they actually re released it. Now, Pi-hole version 5 has been out for uh, a little while now, so now is probably the time to actually switch back to version 5. I've finally had some time to do it, so I'm completing the upgrade today. So let's do this. We'll commit this command. Have we understood it? Yes. Now, I should say, before you do this, you should do a backup. If you've got a Raspberry Pi, take a snapshot of the card, or if you're on a VM, take a snapshot of that. Um, or if you're on a physical box, you will likely need to copy um, your Pi Hole uh, directories just so you've got them as something to roll back to. But don't quote me on backing up Pi Hole. Okay. It says the update has completed now, so let's just do pi-hole v, and we can see it's running version 5, the latest. And since we can see that, we might just do an update as well. And this will do an update. Everything's up to date, so that's good. So if we go back to the pi-hole system here, left 5 this window, if we scroll down to the bottom, we're on Pi-hole version 5, web interface version 5 as well. So that upgrade has completed as required. I'll just check that it's working in here. If we go back to, uh, let's have a look under long-term data, graphics, and I'll select last 30 days, and yes, we have data there, so that is fine. Well, thanks for watching this video on switching Pi-hole to version 5.0 or in terms of actually just learning how you can easily switch between the different branches of Pi-hole using the Pi-hole checkout command. Now, the developers do warn on the website not to run any of those commands unless they actually ask you to. The reason I ran those commands was because back when uh, version 5 was almost released, they opened up the development version for those that wanted to test run it. I gave it a test run, I found it very stable, and I've only just upgraded it now to the release candidate which they have. 
Well, if this video has helped you, please like this video. And if you would like to see more videos like this, subscribe. And don't forget to tap the bell if you would like to get notifications. Thanks for watching. Bye.